Hello everybody. So today I will talk about calculus. The topic today is about differential equations. So now I will show you how to answer. We need to find about complementary solutions. In this situation, this one should be equal to number 0. So we can apply about Cauchy's Euler differential equations. That means I will put about yc equals to s to the power of n. Now if we do first the derivative of this one, we will have about n s to the power of n minus 1. And if I do second derivative of this one, we will have about n multiplied by n minus 1. And we have s to the power of n minus 2. Because we do first derivative of this one, we have n minus 1. And n minus 1 minus 1, you got about n minus 2. So, about this one, that is about this one. And this one, that is about this one. And why that's about this one. So, s squared multiplied by s to the power of n minus 2. We have s to the power of n. This one similar. Now, s to the power of n, we can do about factorization in here. Now, we need to simplify and we just choose about this one in here. This one, we have n squared minus n. We simplify negative n with positive n. And I will put negative number 1 go to the right. And then we have n equals to number 1. n equals to negative number 1. After we find the solutions of this one in here. So we have yc. That's about complementary solutions. So we will have about c number 1. That's about the constant number 1. s to the power of number 1. So we just write about s. And we have c number 2. That's about s to the power of negative number 1. So I can write into 1 over s. Now let's go to particular solutions. So, because we have L and S in here, so YP, that's about particular solution. Should be about A, L and S. Now, if I do first the derivative of this one, we have A over S. Because first the derivative of L and S, you got about 1 over S. Now, if I do second derivative of this one, we have 8 over negative s squared. Because we, we do first derivative of 1 over s, we have negative 1 over s squared. Now, I will put this one going here, this one going here, and this one going here. So, we simplify s square and s square we have negative a. This one you got about positive a. Negative a plus positive a. We just have this one left. And then, we know that coefficient in here is about number 1. 
So negative a equals to number 1. So a equals to negative number 1. So that means this one in here. We put negative sign here. And now we have the final answer. So y equals to yc plus yb equals to this one and negative l and s and this is the final answer that is the end thank you for watching